Monday, kids were enjoying the MLK holiday and the last bit of warm weather before temperatures drop and winter makes its presence known. I do think it's smart, you know, being down here in the south and not having the correct, um, you know, things you need like up in the north where they have snowstorms and stuff like that. With more than 50% of students in Baldwin County Public Schools relying on buses to get them to and from classes, Superintendent Eddie Tyler made the decision to close schools Tuesday and delay the opening of classes Wednesday. In a statement he released to parents, he said in part, I cannot in good conscience require families or buses to be on the roads with ice possible. I appreciate it because I, I would rather them be home with me where I know they're safe than to potentially get out there and not be safe. Even with some feeder patterns likely not affected by icy roads and bridges, all schools will close. Tyler says there's no perfect solution. This is a safe solution. That's my priority, he continued in his statement to parents. For students, it's an extra day without reading, writing, and arithmetic, but parents say they may learn something even more important. Smart to be safe. On the Baldwin County Beat, Debbie Williams, WKRG News 5.